Batch processing is a very powerful feature in raw power, and it's easy to use, but it has some quirks that are important to know about. Batch processing is the ability to make changes to multiple images at the same time. One thing that can be confusing is that batch processing operates in the background, so there's no status in the window as it runs. But this allows you to continue to work while the background processing is happening. To use batch processing, just select a bunch of images in the grid. Then choose an operation from the main menus at the top or from the contextual menus. As you can see, there are a number of actions that can be performed, such as deleting, exporting, applying presets, auto-enhance, revert, and more. The menus will also display the number of items that will be affected. As you can see, export eight items or paste to eight items. Because batch operations take place in the background, you view progress through the task popover in the toolbar. I'll apply auto enhance as a batch process so you can see what happens. You can see the images worked on here, a pause and a cancel. If you're using the file browser, it also generates thumbnails, so that happens as well. The most important thing to know is that batch processing works best when you are not in edit. If you are in edit, then actions are restricted to the image you are currently editing. I'll demonstrate. I'll select these images and bring up the contextual menu. As we saw before, it will apply the effect to all five items. However, if I enter edit and check the contextual menu, you can see that paste and presets only apply to the currently edited image. So for example, if you want to copy and paste adjustments from one image to many, here's one way to do it. Select an image and edit it. I'll just auto enhance it. Then click done. At that point, I can right click on the image and pick copy adjustments. Let's say I want to apply these to every other image in this, uh, in this folder. I can say invert selection and then pick one of these images and pick paste. And then once again, we'll see the background tasks appear. I can pause or cancel by clicking these controls. And there, I have now copied adjustments from one image and pasted them to a whole bunch and again, the key is that I was not in edit at the time. That's a quick tour of batch processing and raw power. Thank you.